All right, good evening, gang. Merry Christmas to you. <laughs> eight degrees. Merry Christmas, right? Uh, eight, man. Uh, it was brutal out there today. Started zero. Uh, and when you look, that's pretty close to the record low back in 1983 at minus three. Man, 66, that sounds nice, right? Far cry from that uh, today. And that is a look live right now at Erie International as the snow and the, st the steam there uh, on the myers Menor RV weather cam. But we're up to 11, right? So that's good. Eight Meadville, five right now, Warren. Uh, we do have winter weather advisories. These are mainly for uh, Erie County, uh, and it's a wind chill advisory south. Uh, speaking to the fact that wind chills are going to be down, you know, 25, 30 below, and it's a winter storm warning up into western New York. All right, let's uh, talk about future cast, dive right in. So look at how close, like tantalizingly close, this Lake Effect snow band is. And notice how it just kind of sags south a little bit. So mainly like northern Erie County, so like the I-90 corridor, that's the best chance of the most steady, persistent snow. Uh, at times we might see this try and uh, come south into Erie County, but uh, again, you can see it just kind of lingers and hangs out northern uh, Erie County. So here's what we're expecting in terms of the amount of snow. It's not going to be a lot, but I think it's just enough for some areas to have that white Christmas. Uh, the highest amounts will be right near and north of I-90 through Sunday, somewhere between 5 and 9 inches. We'll see how far south that band actually makes it. But again, if you get like south, you know, the amounts really drop off, three to six maybe central Erie County north of uh, Edinburgh. Uh, basically from, say, Cambridge Springs south, it's like nothing. Trace to maybe an inch, Corey maybe one to three. Uh, all right, let's talk about and check in with the weather watchers who are checking in with us tonight. Merry Christmas, everyone. Ten right now. Barron, Northeast, seven, Duitville. Ten at uh, Niagara Pier, nine, McCain. Seven, Union City, Corey. Over to Waterford. Eight right now in Edinburgh, seven Cambridge Springs, five in Franklin, six into Youngsville. So the storm actually north of us now, but still spiraling lake effect winds and snow around. And, you know, we've been talking about the storm all week. Look at the cold air all the way down to the Gulf Coast states. Uh, and uh, it's still going to be around tomorrow. So check this out. One of the coldest Christmas Eve days on uh, since like 1983, some 40 years ago, warmest 66, coldest was 11, beat that today. We only got to 8, snowiest 13.1, and then for Christmas Day, we all remember 2017 uh, t uh, with 20.9 inches, of course, depending on what measurement you believe. I'm going to go a little long. Sorry, Chantel. Here's your forecast for Christmas Eve. Uh, and into Christmas Day, so some lake snow again, northern Erie County, two to four inches, wind chills will feel like zero, as high temperatures will only be in the teens. Snow showers, <clears throat> especially northern parts uh, up into Erie County and uh, up into northern Chautauqua County, that's the best chance for the most persistent snows, 12 to 17. Uh, and then we'll have some leftover snow showers and flurries Monday. General light snow Tuesday, not quite as cold, 29. And then we start to thaw. Wednesday, 40 near 50 by Thursday, and as we get ready to say so long to 22, I think we're in the low uh, 50s with some wet weather. Well, a lot of Buckle people up for that. that. Yeah. Uh, Merry Christmas, everyone. We'll be a little snowy uh, around these parts tomorrow. All right, Craig, thank you very much.